Hey guys, Brett Okamoto here with uh, Naval Officer One, Kamara Usman, I think, right? Is it the yes. Naval Officer One in the new Black Panther movie that just was released? And we are in, we're in New York City. We're in a great setting here for that to happen. I mean, bro, you're like Hollywood, man. You're in New York City, you got a big movie coming out. Like, you're wearing red, like what's going on here? I mean, I said it, they, they're calling me Hollywood Usman, but they have no idea, I mean that. <laughs> you know, it's a... Uh, I, I, I like that term because it's like, they're like, Hollywood, Hollywood, if someone's Hollywood, that's a term of, you know, they made it. They've, they've done mm -hmm. well. Mm -hmm. So why not? Hollywood Usman. And it's fun, right? Yeah. I mean, what did you do last was, night when the movie came out? Uh, to be honest, I was having Chinese food with Justin Gaethje. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds good. I didn't, I didn't realize it came out. Mm -hmm. I, I know it was on the 11th, which is today's the 11th. Mm -hmm. So I didn't realize it was actually last night. Mm -hmm. So I'm sitting there, and then all of a sudden, phone's going off, and phone's going off, and phone's going off. And I'm just like, what is this? And I start seeing people saying, was that you that I saw in the, in the movie? And yeah. I'm like, oh, the yeah. movie's out. That's so cool. Okay. Yes, it's amazing. And when we, when we spoke about it uh, a few months ago, you, weren't sure, you never know if they're going to keep you in the film or if you're going to get cut. So how much did you stress over that, and how, how happy were you when they said, yep, dude, you made the, you made the final cut? I, I didn't really stress over it just because in, that, in the process, uh, for me, this, is, this isn't my first this isn't my my living. This is how this isn't yeah. how I make a living. Yeah. So it's not, you know, I didn't go into it with the expectation of oh everyone I need to be seen in this movie so I can continue to get roles and do things. You know, I understand who I am. I am uh, a UFC uh, welterweight fighter, and um, and that's my first job. Yeah. And so, you know, with this, it was just it was just a cool experience to be able to see it, to be able to witness it, because we all sit at home and and, and we all watch movies, and then we all go. Ah, I can do that. Yeah, yeah. I, I can do that. But then once you're actually on set and you actually get to watch these professionals do their job, it's just it, it drives it home of how difficult this is. For sure. And it'd be like um, you go into a uh, to an MMA gym with a bunch of champions in the room, and you're like the amateur, and you're like, man, I don't want to, I don't want to look bad in front of these guys, right? Like, was there some of that? Yeah. Oh no, absolutely. <laughs> because uh, the first day on set, that my first scene. I am on set and I had to do a scene in the room with Angela Bassett, yeah. Winston Duke, everyone, literally the, the, the cast of the movie yeah. is there and I'm doing the scene and I'm standing literally a few feet away from Angela Bassett. And this is a woman that I've, I've admired her work mm -hmm. since I was a teenager. And so I'm just sitting there like, Crap! I can't mess up my yeah. I can't mess up my one line. Yeah. <laughs> and lo and behold, after 20 takes, I do forget the line. Yeah. I'm like, wow. Okay, I see how difficult this is now. Oh, the fact that you're even getting lines. Uh, so, no. so I said Naval Officer One. What can you tell us about Naval Officer One? Actually, obviously, without giving away too much of the plot, of course. Uh, but, uh, can't give away too much, but uh, one thing that I can say is uh, there's a lot of fighting that takes place in the water, in this movie. And so, um, you know, with a lot of things going on in the water, you kind of, and, and w with a kingdom like Wakanda, you kind of need the, the Navy to be strong and mm -hmm. to be there. So um, I, I play Naval Officer One, and, you know, that's, I'm, I'm in charge of some things that go on in the water. So, you know, that, that's as much as I can give away, yeah. but I can say a lot of this takes place with the water. <laughs> that's, that's so cool, man. Well, we actually, we have a, a scene of it, which I, I haven't seen yet, so I'm actually really excited to get to this part. Let's take a look at the scene, and then uh, maybe I'll, I'll get, some, get your thoughts on some of it. This paper has had no evidence of any activity at all. Oh, the river border has been breached. Huh? If my soldiers were present, this fishman would be bound before us as we if speak. If your muscle brains were present, they would still be there, choking on their fuzzy adornments. You bald-headed demon. Show some respect, you two. Respect? These men should be ashamed to show their faces. Watch your tone, Jabari. Ooh, 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 What's that like for you to watch that? <laughs> It's, um, I didn't even know that I was going to make the movie. I, I'm, I'm, I'm sitting there at the premiere and I'm watching. I'm like, oh, wow, that made the movie. So it, it's, uh, it feels great for me because the first Black Panther, my daughter and I watch it mm -hmm. over, we've watched it over 20, 30 times. Mm -hmm. 
And so uh, to now go back home, sit in our movie room and uh, and watch the new Black Panther. Yeah. And for her to always remember that daddy's in that movie, that that's that means the world to me. For sure. When you're standing in a room like that, obviously those are all visual effects. Like, are you trying to like like picture that what it looks like? And is it hard? Is it hard to like pretend that you're in this? Is that weird? I would say that's the that's what the biggest challenge about this is uh, the fact that for what I do for a living, it's that's literally our our, our slogan is as real as yeah it is, yeah yeah as a as UFC fighter, and then now having to play a character and pretend, and then make everyone in the world believe this is is. It was difficult because then you're in your head and you're wondering in your head how you're looking on camera because yeah, yeah. You're, you're thinking in your head how you're going to deliver these lines. So, uh, you know, it wasn't big, long, elaborate lines, but it was just enough to me to get my feet wet and, mm -hmm. and understand whether I can do this or not. Yeah, which is just a couple more. Um, is this something you really want to do? Or, or like at now that you've really seen it and what it would take, like, oh, maybe I'll dabble in it. Like what, what kind of level do you want to be involved in this? I want to be very big in this. I, yeah. I, I really, this is something that I really want to do. But first, I need to finish my day job first. Yeah. You yeah. know, I, I need to get to a point in my day job where I, I'm confident and, and comfortable with what I've done there and say that, okay, yeah. now I really want to embark on this journey. And yeah. because I, I, I don't really, I don't really half step anything. If I'm going to do it, yeah. I'm full in, I'm all in. And so, uh, I, I, I want to finish my day job and then and then go and say, yeah, you know what, I want to be all in on this. Mm. So last thing, and you kind of mentioned it, but uh, when I spoke to you before the movie came out, you said, I just cannot wait for my daughter to see it. I cannot wait to watch it with my daughter. So you, you mentioned you were in the movie room. What, what was it like watching that with your daughter? Well, she hasn't seen it yet. She ha yeah. We're, well, I've, we're gonna see well I wasn't Monday. sure if you had gotten like a... a no, this was the, the first Black Panther we watch all the time. Yeah. But um, we're going to watch this together on Monday. Okay, so you couldn't get like an advanced copy or something like that. They're probably pretty oh, strict no. about that, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm pretty, they, were, they were strict enough to where I was getting the lines the morning of. Okay. So that's yeah, how that's strict nuts. they are. So, uh, yeah, I can't, I can't wait. Uh, I want to take her to the, we're going to go to the theaters on Monday and, and uh, watch this. You're going to watch it in the, in the theater? Yeah, we're going to watch it. It's a private show, and so we're going to watch it that day. And then, you know, as soon as it comes out every day, for the rest of her, uh, her her young days until she goes off to college and uh, daddy doesn't have to force her to watch it again. Uh, that's so awesome, man. I'm, I'm really, really happy for you. You come a long, long way from the 30% news, man, dude. Look, look where you. you're Thank at you. now. <laughs> <laughs> well, we appreciate your time, man. And uh, man, enjoy, enjoy that time watching it with your daughter. That would Thank be very you. special.